Last time on Little Mikey. It's natural in that he goes out and practice on his own. Today is All-Star Saturday, and I'm so proud that my fourth grade All-Star, Michael Stokes, came in and dominated with his skills and his talent. I could tell that his frustration was growing more and more with some of the coaches and some of the players and the way things were handled during the game. Man, something about this kid that's 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 different, and uh, everyone sees it, not just me. <laughs> I let him finish out as much of the game as I possibly could before I had to pull him. But I just don't know if we're going to make it to the next game. Uh, uh -huh. How was the game? Uh, it was all right. All-star game. They had no familiarity with each other. Also, the coaches don't know who they are too much, but it was fun. He said it's set up in a 3-2. Them yeah. kids don't even know what man-to-man -man is. <laughs> <laughs> It's all good. Your blue, your blue belt. I mean, your uh, blue hat. You always think your own kid is good, but when other people tell you, like, man, you need to do more things with him, or we, need, we want him to play on this team, or they want, kept asking me to, he five, and kept asking me to oh, yeah, let him play up with the eight and nine-year-olds. And then he started performing with them when he was five years old. I knew uh, when Rhino and other teams started calling to try to get him to come move and play, I knew, okay, there's something to this, and it's special. He plays a lot of catcher, shortstop. Uh, he pitches a lot. Uh, he plays some center field. Um, he wears a number one, you know, because in his mind, you know, baseball, he's number one. You know, that's what he told me. So uh, we're going to live with that for now. Both runs count. Let's go. Bring it out here, guys. Come on, come on. You should have worn it anyway. Yeah. Hey, guys, come on. Go out to coach. We, we, we're not packing up. Let's go, let's go. Baseball is his first love. Most people don't know that. They don't know that baseball, he, he, he'd give up basketball in a minute. But he ain't never going to give up baseball. Good job, guys. Good he loves both sports. But um, I think that it's good for him. I think kids should be multi-diverse. You shouldn't pigeonhole a kid as you never know. He might not decide to do anything when he gets older.
after playing basketball and baseball, I just wanted to come home and play with my friends, but I got surprised seeing my dog. What's up, Kilo? He's nine years old. Where are five foot falls to go? He's a fourth grader. And I'm good with this. He's my third child. Hands up. Hands to I have two older girls. He has a little brother. Um, he uh, loves to play video games. Loves to ride his bike. He's an AB student. He's very uh, well mannered kid. Very polite. You gotta step here, remember? Step here. Has a great personality, very helpful, very considerate. Come on, one last hit, Bruiser. He's a hard worker. Everybody loves him. Yeah, you want to step right to that pitcher. Step right to that pitcher. No recoil. That's why I'm saying put the put your hands by your ear. So you have no recoil. You just go right into the pitch. Twelve big step. I'm gonna put some ball here. You got a ball here. You got a ball here. You when I point to a ball, you go jump up. Right. Okay. A lot of Michael's athletic ability, you know, comes from me and his mom, but a lot of it, most of it comes from hard work, the preparation that he puts into everything he does. You know, it's amazing sometimes that when we're working, he can tell me like, Dad, let me try this and this, and you know, he'll figure it out. Even if I didn't figure it out. You know, it's amazing how smart he is and the things and he do to get better. You know, simply amazing. How do you feel about playing two sports? Happy, I did it since I was five. You don't get tired? No. Which one you like more, baseball or basketball? Baseball. Why is that? Because I played since I was three, and basketball started when I was like five. Who your favorite baseball player? A hobby bias. Start with Jackie Robinson. It depends if you're talking about history or now. Overall, baseball, who your favorite player? Jackie Robinson. Overall, basketball, who your favorite basketball player? Michael Jordan. What you think about your dad? In baseball or basketball? Both. Just as a coach. Coach? Oh, he's good. What you think about him as a father? Better. <laughs> That's what's up. You want to say hi to anybody? Uh, thank you to anybody? My grandma and my grandma's mom. So my great-grandma. And your granddad. May he rest in peace. Yeah. 
Alright, alright, appreciate you.